Hey, everyone, so this will be a speed test here between the iPad Mini 6th Generation 2021 and then the Samsung Tab A7 here. So first, real quick, these are the Geekbench scores. So single 316, multi is 1415, that is from the uh, A7. Uh, for what I could find online for the Mini, a single is 1587 and then the multi is 4404 so better numbers on the mini uh as i imagine people would expect uh for something that costs over double the price uh so yeah let's just get into the speed test here sorry about the reflection i uh, just kind of asking to make that go away so we're going to use chrome for both these this time all right then we'll go to BestBuy.com, both have been cleared of their histories. All right, one, two, three. So this iPad is going to win. Uh, I'll try not to talk too, too much during this video. You guys can let me know what you think in the comments below. Go into TVs and projectors here. Just go ahead and hit the first one, the first Samsung there. Uh, both of these are hooked up, of course, to the same Wi Fi, which is just my home Wi Fi. Move down here, we will hit overview. There we go. And let's go down here, we'll hit overview. We'll hit specs. Hit specs. Go up to the top here and hit the picture. Never remember if I can zoom in on that or not. You cannot. I uh, see the only thing that's open. Here we're at Geekbench here. The uh, only thing that is open is going to be Google Chrome on both these. Uh, again, I do not have Geek Geekbench on the iOS uh, Apple because I believe you have to pay for it. Um, yeah. So, so we don't have it. Next, go over to Google Sheets. So this is, of course, a spreadsheet. Go over to exercise. Zoom in a tiny bit. Well, zoom in a good amount. Let me make sure you get rid of the correct one here. Because on here, it opens up two things. On here, it only opens up the one. Uh, next, we go into their respective app. Apple Store, uh, Apple Stores, App Stores here. So Google Play Store and then the App Store. One, two, three. There we go. We'll type in Pokemon and Pokemon. Uh, we will do a sound test too at the end of this video. Uh, both of these actually are pretty good sounding. Hit Pokemon Go here. We we'll just hit. Here we go. We we'll just hit the first picture. All right, and then next we'll hit Roblox. But let me make sure my volumes are off. Uh, Roblox likes to give out copyright strikes. Uh, one, two, three, for pressure any music they have. Not that there is music when you first turn it on, but still. All right. There we go. I love how both these put it into the position you had it in. Uh, so, yeah, just nice. We don't have to move your iPad or tablet around. And I will go into the camera. 
One, two, three. Okay. Again, you guys can let me know which one you think is winning, which one you think is doing better, uh, which one you guys like better. All right, we'll do into the calendar here. Let's try that one one more time because the apple was a bit odd. So again, we're going to the calendar. So one, two, three. They're Okay, they're both really super fast. All right, next will be YouTube's one, two, three. Uh, Explorer plus subscription library. All right, now let's go back through each of these that we opened up. So first is Chrome. A7 is reloading. Uh, next is Google Sheets. Uh, a bit of a reload on here, not 100% reload though. I'm sorry about the uh, reflection. I don't know why it's so bad today. Usually it's not that bad. One, two, three, four. I don't know why I said one, two, three. Anyway, App Store, that's what I meant to say. Uh, let's see here. Roblox. There we go. Both were excellent on that. Sorry, my camera decided to move there. Uh, speaking of camera, going to the cameras here. And then calendar. All right, now we'll do a uh, sound test. All right, so both of these actually have four speakers, quad speakers, turn the fan all the way up on the iPad mini here. We'll start with that. The iPad mini sounds pretty good, especially for an eight inch or so tablet. I am so sorry, I just totally whacked the camera there. Hopefully they're not making a bad noise. Uh, next we'll go, of course, A7. Turn the up all the way. Got any quad speakers, just like on the iPad, which I didn't show, but they're on two and then two. You guys can let me know, but the A7 is definitely louder, uh, but both of them sound pretty dang good. Uh, yes, yeah, so you guys let me know what you think of both these tablets. Uh, yeah, I appreciate you all watching. I hope you have a good one. I'll see you all next time. Goodbye.